Today let's quickly build a image gallery application. Here is my canvas with an ID of my canvas with two pixels black dotted border. Once the HTML page loads, it invokes canvas method. It checks if an element with an ID my canvas is actually present on the HTML page and if the browser supports get context method. Since it is an image gallery application, I'll take a take an array called my images and input the names that is the path of all the images present inside my images directory. So these are the images present inside the images folder and my array name is my images. Next. I'll take a variable called img and create an image tag on the fly using create elements method of JavaScript. I'll also take an index variable and I'll call it i so that it would be useful to index through these image paths present inside the array my images. Since image tag has been set on the fly I'll set some of its properties like width and height and its source I'll set its width to the width of canvas I'll quickly copy and paste and do the same for height now by using set interval method I'll invoke this method for every 2000 milliseconds that is for every two seconds now I'll set the source of the image tag I'll set it on the fly by using our array my images and the index i after assigning the index I'll increment it by one so the i plus plus here now once the image is loaded inside this img tag I'll call an anonymous function and check if the index variable i its index is actually greater than the number of elements present inside my images array that is if the index i is greater than or equal to the length of the array if that is the case assign back the value 0 to index variable i now by using draw image I'll draw the image present in the img variable onto the canvas at 0 comma 0 from 0 comma 0 to know more about draw image method follow the link I'm showing on this video screen let's have a look at it on the browser for two seconds one and two now start so these are the images I have in my images folder once it reaches the final image it gets back to the first image and then loops through like this until the browser is running this is our first image this is because I am setting the index i to zero once the index reaches the maximum length of the array that is my images please share this video with your friends on facebook google plus linkedin twitter stumble upon etc please stay subscribed to technotip.com and to our youtube channel follow the link present in the description section for more notes please like this video on youtube